This episode is brought to you by our friends at Hover, the easiest way to buy domain names and do more with them. Get 10% off today by visiting hover.com slash butterscotch. Andy Moore Crispin here at E3 2010 in an incredibly loud Ubisoft booth. Just sitting outside, behind us is a bunch of dance gaming going on. But we're a little bit more interested in the new Assassin's Creed. I'm here with JF from Ubisoft, who's going to tell us a bit about the game. So basically, what's new in the new Assassin's Creed? Uh, well, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood takes place right after the events of Assassin's Creed 2, so it's the continuing story of uh, Ezio Auditore da Firenze. Right. Uh, this time around, he's going to Rome, uh, the uh, heart of corruption and power of the Borgias and he's gonna have to uh, build a brotherhood and recruit assassins to take on the Templars uh, head-on. Okay, very cool. Now, I understand we're not actually able to play the game here at E3. We can only see kind of your, your devs playing it. That's right. Do we know when we're going to be seeing this game kind of hitting store shelves? November 16th. November 16th. In, in the U.S. Very cool. this year. Very cool. So, well, leave us through some of the, kind of the gameplay mechanics for anyone who's maybe not familiar with Assassin's Creed. Well, Assassin's Creed is all about being a blade in the crowd. So, mastering your environment. You can run anywhere on, uh, you know, in three dimensions. So, it's an open world. Uh, you can climb buildings, you can do some free running, some parkour, and it's also a stealth game, a st social stealth gameplay where you blend in the crowd, get close to your uh, target, Right. you're in, you're out, nobody saw where you are, uh, who did it, and uh, that's in a nutshell uh, what our game's about. Very cool. Well, I guess Assassins, it doesn't really pay to kind of go out there with guns blazing and just kind of shoot arrows everywhere and cut a bunch of people. I mean, you could do that. I mean, to, the player could decide how to how to play it, right. but it's much more fun if you actually play it the way it was intended to be from the beginning. Right. So now what kind of what kind of uh, what kind of like new gameplay mechanics are we dealing with here? The the horses are back. Ah uh, yeah. Uh, well, Rome is uh, for those of you who played Assassin's Creed 2, Rome is three times the size of Florence. Oh, okay. So it's a huge city. So uh, improving the horse was uh, was a must for us. So you can actually fight on horse now in just like in uh, ways. Right. Uh, do some advanced acrobatics, escape. You can uh, fight against other NPCs on horse. Uh, and uh, yeah, and it's, since it's so big, it's a great way to get around. Very cool. So that's Assassin's Creed Brotherhood coming November 19th? 16th. November 16th. We'll look forward to seeing that one. For all the details, hit up the show notes on butterscotch.com. JF, thank you very much. Thank you, guys. This episode is brought to you by our friends at Hover, the easiest way to buy domain names and do more with them. Get 10% off today by visiting hover.com slash butterscotch.